Hello everyone, this is Ken with Power Source Electric and today we're going to talk about circuit testers and I'm going to show you one right here. This is a circuit tester. It's made by Greenlee. Give you a little bit closer view. Uh, what this device does is it plugs directly into the wall. Uh, there's different lights on the back side of it and those lights are indicator lights. It's going to tell you if there's a problem with that circuit. Um, right on the front part of the circuit analyzer, circuit tester, is going to give you a description of what that problem could be. So we're going to talk about some of those problems and I'm going to show you how uh, this circuit tester gets plugged into the wall. It's not a meter, just like the voltage detector is not a meter. Um, it doesn't gauge how much electricity is going in any, any certain area. It doesn't tell us resistance. It doesn't, um, it doesn't do those things. So this is a very simple tool. It's just a quick analysis of um, an outlet to make sure that it's working properly. Um, also, uh, I use it as an indicator if I have power on on a circuit. If I'm getting ready to turn, open that outlet up, I want to make sure that the power's off. So I plug in my circuit tester, uh, lights light up, I flip my breaker off, I know that it's off, and it's very handy for that. Um, another note on the circuit tester is we do not use any of these types of devices until we've checked them on a known live circuit. We want to make sure that the power um, the power is to that circuit, and that circuit is working just fine, and we're going to plug in our tester, make sure our tester is working fine before we test it on our work area. This uh, little circuit tester could have been dropped 10 times and now this time it just doesn't work so I need to make sure that this circuit tester is working properly before I get started on my project. So let's take a look and see what, um, what the lights look like and uh, how the indicators work on it. Okay now we have our circuit tester. It's plugged into the wall. Just a standard household uh, three prong plug and uh, we have our two indicator lights on. It's telling us that that circuit is good. Um, now if I wanted to turn off that circuit, I'd go over to the breaker, uh, flip it off before I were to get inside of that outlet if I wanted to change it out or if, um, if there was some type of trouble in there. I want to make sure my circuit is clear, it's off, and it's safe to work okay, on. Okay, let's take a look at what each one of the uh, indicators means on the back of the circuit tester. The first one says open ground. Uh, there's three wires connected to your outlet. Um, one wire is going to be the ground wire, which will be bare or green. Um, open ground, open and electrical uh, contacts means that it's not connected. So somewhere in that circuit we have an open ground, and um, that means that the bare wire or green wire is not connected in that circuit. The next one is open neutral, just like an open ground means that the wire is not connected to that circuit, or we've lost the neutral, meaning that the wire could have come um, it could have been disconnected maybe at the wire nut, uh, maybe it's been old and um, there's been some corrosion and it's not making contact anymore. So that's what would give us an open, uh, open ground or open neutral. Open hot, same thing. Um, the hot wire has been disconnected and now we have no power coming to it. Uh, next one is hot ground reverse. Uh, somewhere in that circuit, uh, the ground has got some power on it and now our indicator is showing hot ground reverse meaning that um, somewhere the ground wire is touching the hot wire. Um, next one we go down, hot neutral reverse. Um, with a hot neutral reverse it could very well somebody could have um, switched the wires and put the uh, hot wire on the silver screw and the, and the neutral wire on the gold screw and we could have a reverse on that. Um, next one is um, correct. So there we have uh, the two indicator lights on the right, or the colored indicator lights would be um, on and the outlet would be working properly. Now on the hot uh, neutral reversed, I have seen that indicator come up when um, the neutral has been loose um, inside the circuit. So when you're tracking those type of problems down, uh, make sure you check all the surrounding circuits or surrounding outlets to make sure that um, it's not just that one outlet before you start taking it apart. If you have three, um, you're going to check the two outside first um, before the one in the middle. One outlet could cause the problem for the other three. So that's when you're going to um, disconnect power. Uh, make sure that you have no power. Use your voltage detector to make sure there's no power inside that box. You're going to look for any type of wires that are uh, disconnected or loose. Um, if you don't visibly see anything that you can correct, 
you should call your licensed electrician and uh, let him take care of that for you. Thanks again for coming to PowerSourceTutorials.com and checking out our video on circuit detectors.